Now that the state is nearing phase four of its rebound plan, many tourist attractions are seeing visitors starting to return. And Idaho News 6 reporter Alex Grant has more on how Blaine County has been affected. Tourism is one of the leading forces in Blaine County's economy, and it has certainly felt the impact of COVID-19. Well, because we have such a tourism and recreation based economy, we have really been hit hard. There's a lot of restaurants and uh, retail has been hit hard, too. Winter and summer are the most popular times for tourism in Blaine County. Since people have been cooped up for so long, summer activities are seeing loads of people come out, even slightly above the average. The whole Wood River Valley, I mean, every left or right you take as you drive, the whole valley is full of places to go play, explore, mountain bike, hike, uh, fish. And so uh, we have what folks are looking for. Local businesses, restaurants, and hotels are seeing numbers rise again as well, but not what it would normally be. For the workers in those fields, it has been tough. You only spend so much money when you're buying some flies or, you know, uh, and not being able to eat in as much and more to-go food makes it a lot harder. A lot of our wait staff and the hotel staffs don't have as much work, don't have those tips coming in, which then trickles down and makes things a little more challenging. While the summer is looking very promising to help the economy, there is still concern about the long-term impacts this could have. Summer means so much to our business community that we really have to do really well in the summer to get us through that fall slack period of September, October, November, even a little bit of December before the skiing starts. Despite the concern, there is hope that the economy won't be as affected as originally thought. In Blaine County, I'm Alex Grant, Idaho News 6.